Oh man. It's almost 4.30 family. <sighs> I erased my uh, alarm app. Forgot to reset the shit. I woke up at 4.16. So I must apologize. I must apologize. But I'm up now. Hopefully some of y'all catch him. Got some bread that I'm about to go on in. Actually, it's more like a cake that I'm about to go and, and, and bake. The shit rolls overnight, which is what I want. Now I'm going to take it in here, put it in the oven, wait for some of y'all to join me. What's up, Brother Kwame? I forgot to set my alarm, dog. That's all I can say. I erased my app. Didn't set the alarm. Now I'm up. So, I'm still getting set up. A great, great emoji. I have made it to... I completed another 21 day. And Gustav a challenge about to start another one. This one I focus on mastering a habit. So I haven't picked up any tobacco products in over 21 days. <sighs> I'm not feeding. You know, so I'm cool. So now what I'm going to move to is mastering some of the financial situations. So that I can always have me some, some fresh ambrosia on the table. You know what I'm saying? So I can... Um, start putting making investments rather than taking away from them. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, I use the Goose Up Challenge to help move me um in certain directions. So it don't just have to be about well it is about just changing the days. But it's also about changing not just the thoughts but changing the actions that go along with um with how we live. Um so, man, but great emoji. Uh, I would make some juice, but like yesterday I'm cutting up the fruit. Damn, they cut off my finger. Thought, word, and deed are one. Word, or at least they should be. Hell, they used to be. You know what I'm saying? Nowadays, you can have thought, word, and Thought, word, and deed, and they be on three different states. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's crazy nowadays. So, yeah, it's it's supposed to be, but it's you know we 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 witness how it's not. Hell, we got a president right now. Thought, word, and deed aren't one. Now, <laughs> politics is about thought, word, and deed not being one. I could go on and as long as I could change the language or add the words like. Uh, what's the word I hated when Obama came in? Transparency. Right? You know what I'm saying? It's like people honestly believe that the government can be transparent. If in three different states, then what is said, done, or thought is not. That's right. That's right. It can't, it, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's not real. So, so we got to we got to make that reality real again. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, thoughts, word, and deeds. You know what I'm saying? That is the key to creating. You know what I'm saying? If if we moving back towards divinity, then it has to all line back up. But if we just happy being where we are right now, it don't matter, do it? Discerning the real from the unreal. Very true. Very true. Learning, you know what I'm saying? Once again, once again, we see that ain't happening. We see that ain't happening. Um, at least for most, you know. So let's go and take a sip. Get your water. I know you already had your water, so I'm gonna catch up with you.
My fault. Bring them out. 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 All right, for those of you that's joining me, that'll be joining me a little bit later or whatever, you'll be checking the video out yesterday. I went to the Per Unk. It was uh, it was pretty good. Yeah, it was great. Um, so I'm gonna start participating in a lot of the the stuff in the community. So y'all see me, y'all see me doing a little bit more streaming from other events so that y'all don't have to be just caught up in the house with Brother Hot Tim, right? Um, so make sure you get to water the rules. Excuse me. The rules of um, of the daily toast are the same. We need to do our water. I'm, I shoot for 32 ounces. I'm on 16 right now. Then we do our toast. Water ain't going down easy today. Must because it's the end of the summer for me. Yeah, it's about to start. Man. So I'm going to take a uh, my golden root also known as rhodiola this one had 60 vegetable capsules so we'll be moving in on 30 days real soon and I'll be the, I, I'm not really feeling any super effects I'm just being honest with y'all um, Last one. Last one. Lift up them glasses. Now, I'm understanding I can send invites, so I'm about to start finding out who want to be invited early in the morning. Y'all can use, I guess y'all can use Facebook as an alarm. Except for one, I don't set my alarm. And except for the, I don't know if we could call it the weekend. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? But um um Kuumba and Imani, because I'm not I'm not getting up early on those days. Not super early anyway. Thanks for the share, brother. Mm. Throwing a shot of the that the vinegar. So now, one of the things I do notice is that for those people who would like me to ship, I can ship. I can ship the vinegar. And what you can do with the vinegar is you can take the vinegar, do a little shot like like a third of the way up on a glass. You might not even need that much, and you can put water in it. And you got, I ain't going to say pretty much, you got close to ambrosia, not quite ambrosia, but it have all the health benefits. Or you can get you the, uh, the you get the vinegar, throw a little bit of honey in there and just give it a couple of days. Hell, you got you, you got your own batch. I gotta ship out another package because uh, one of them just blew up. So I came up with an um, idea how to ship them, how to ship the ambrosia on these hot days, right? Because when it's super hot, 
it's rough. Alright? So here we go. First, giving honor to the Creator by whatever name you choose to call the Creator. We lift up our glass. We lift up our glass high. And we ask the Creator to bless us and guide us and give us strength to open our eyes. You know what I'm saying? So that we can see uh, what's real and separated from the unreal. You know what I'm saying? We ask the Creator to bless us and, 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 and touch our hearts and touch our minds and, and, and allow us to really identify and truly identify uh, the emotions that we are dealing with so that we can actually start transforming some of our thoughts and some of our some of our deeds and some of our actions right and guiding them right because a lot of times we can't do that because we all mixed up on the inside so we just create open us up and guide us so we lift up our glass and we say our shade from there we move to our personal ancestors and of course you know we lift up our glass for our personal ancestors because it's important to remember those um those that are directly in our family line because nobody gonna remember them but us right so we need to go and lift them up and we need to go on and drink for them we need to go and call their names out right and a lot of ancestors that dwell with us even for a couple of moments you know what i'm saying because our energy our energy feeds them right and, and, and it helps and it helps them right so we lift up our glass and we remember those who came before us. So I go down my family line. I challenge you to start building up on your family line. I call on Miles Brown, Miss Ann, Robin the Texana Davis, Hunter Brown Sr., Rosalie Tilly, Georgia, and William Walton, Christopher and Fanny Gatson, Aunt Lena, Uncle Chris, Geneva Brown, Cleveland Brown, Wash Ellis, Margaret Ellis, Cecil Ellis. Avira Brown, Katie Ellis, Wash Ellis Jr., Herman Brown II, Barbara Twiggs, Gina Gaines, Jamal Jones, Jeremiah Tappan, John Fillard. Brother for notes, also known as Montague Pittman L. No more X, a pet my rhyme. Elder Donaldson, Elder Harrison, Elder Farmer, uh, Elder Millie Dixon. Dr. Marianne Williams, Tony Clark, Pastor Yusuf Weston, John Fillard, Kojo Kamal, Terrell Dunbar, lift up our glass and we say our shame. From there we move to our to the present moment today is a mojo. Um, my cheat sheet is in the car, and since I'm running late, I'm not gonna get it. So we know that there's a mojo. Uh, we know that the modic principle for the day is truth. We know that the hermetic law for the day is uh, mentalism, which I have to kind of go back and reflect on a little bit more. I gotta do a little bit more study on that. Because I don't want I don't want people to start getting at least those of you that's 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 coming in and and just now learning. I don't want you to get caught in your head because mentalism could be a very dangerous piece, especially in the Western world, because we start we get caught up in our heads. I need you to be caught up in the whole being. Um So we lift up our glass and we say our shay. From there, ooh, that bacon smells good. I gotta go make sure it ain't burning. So we lift up our glass and we toast this moment, cause in this moment is our power. And we say our shape. From there we move to our children, our children's children onto affinity. It's very important that we toast them and we let them know that we appreciate all that they're doing, 
right? And that we award their progress and that we inspire when they're not making progress. We inspire them to move when they're not making progress. So we lift our glass. We say our say. From there, we move on. And I toast you, my friends. Toast you. Lift my glass to you. And I say, whatever issues you may have, now's the time to toast them. Now's the time to place them up. You know what I'm saying? We got people all over the country watching. We got people coming in at different times watching. We got different people with different levels of consciousness coming in. So you never know who might be able to help you with your issue or who might have influence with certain ancestors to help you out. So go on and toast. My food is burning. Hold on. And we say, I say, I say, I say, I wish you peace, power, joy, and 100 years. Hold on. I just put it in. I know, I know, I know. This is not smelling like it. Woo! Lord have mercy. Alright, it's not wasting, it's not my fault, it's not burning, let me tell y'all what's happening, so, in the banking process, the banking be calling my brother, huh, <laughs> no, in the banking process, right, so what I got is, I'm using sourdough, right, so all the things that I bake, I use sourdough as the foundation, so, now, for those that don't understand what sourdough is, sourdough is an ancient way of making bread, where you have um, a live yeast. Of course, those that have been following me, you know that the ambrosia is a live yeast, so the sourdough I use is, is built up off of the ambrosia, so I use ambrosia to... to um, to, I use the yeast that create the ambrosia to make my sourdough. So I have a sourdough that I keep alive. I feed once a week. So when you bake with the sourdough, even when you're baking like cakes or whatever, it rises. So I, I, I mixed the stuff up last night. I let it sit and it rose. Now it, it rose above the level of the pan. Right? So now I'm baking it and it's spilling out onto the oven. See, because I'm telling you right now, family, part of our issue is that we're eating dead food. Right? One of my elders told me a long time ago, if you want if you want to be life, eat life. If you want to be death, eat death. And he looked at me while I was eating my, my sandwich. I'm like, dude, I'm not about to pick up no no asparagus sandwich. He was eat he was eating a um you know the he was eating a sprout sandwich. I'm looking at that at that point in time, like, man, I'm not about to pick up no damn sprout. I'm I'm not putting down this chicken sandwich that I'm eating and pick up some damn sprouts. And lo and behold, less than three years after he told me that, I was eating a sprout sandwich. And damn it was good, right? So, we're gonna finish up our drink. I'm gonna move to now I gotta go over to YouTube and do this video real quick. Um but yo, I want to thank every last one of you for joining me. Be sure to check out the Per Ankh, um, the Per Ankh discussion. Check out um, the comedic New Year celebration that we had on Kaumba. You know what I'm saying? I want to make sure that I'm plugging y'all in to the different things that I'm gonna be participating in in the uh, in the upcoming year. Because one of the things I'm doing now is one, I want to expose y'all to different people doing a very similar things to me. It don't have to be the exact same thing, but all of us have all levels of mastery. Uh, for those of you that want to meet Brother Kwame, y'all go going to check him out because yesterday he was um, he was asking some great questions yesterday. Um, uh, he said, Peace Fam and Divine Conversation is the fourth Sunday of the month. I'm quite sure I'll get a reminder. 
know what I'm saying? Because I don't be track, I don't be tracking time all like that. You know, I need, you know. But once I get into the rhythm, I'm cool. So divine conversations is when we discuss. I'm assuming is when we discuss what was presented um, during the per unk um, a little bit more in depth, right? So you know, um, so you got. I guess so. We have um, per unk once a month, and then we have divine conversation once a month. Not to over, not not to overdo it, right? Because you know, uh, you know, as black folks, sometimes we can overdo it, right? You know, those of you that ever ever, ever went to church, uh, it's sort of like having a paper rock. Shit just don't stop. You see what I'm saying? So you know. Because because we're conscious and a lot of us been involved and stuff, it, it, we we kind of know. All right, you, you got to kind of uh, slow some stuff down for for black folks. All right, so I I haven't decided on exactly what I'm gonna cover during with the uh, uh, prompt is second Imani and divine conversation is fourth Imani. See, man, you done made me say. You done made me say this day, then you reminded me, man. You stop, you always trying to be funny, man. All right, I'm going to knock out the push-ups. I'm just running a little behind. All right, so I got to get ready because teacher's coming back to school. But I think I'm going to do a discussion. I, I'm going to talk a little bit more about the birth. Um, talk a little bit more about the uh, the divine time we in. Talk a little bit more about the the the... the um, the the comedic deities. I'm thinking of. I'm actually thinking about hitting on my eye today. You know, I think I think I might hit on my eye today. You know what I'm saying? In a respectful way. You know, not that I flirt with my eye, but you know, I'm that old. I you know, I might I might have flirted with my eye. I am that old, right? So hey, this brother out Tim. I'm about to head out. I gotta go on and wipe the bottom of this oven off before it wakes up the whole house. Shouts out to Brother Kwame and whoever else joins me, um, whether now or later. All right, peace, fam.